Hi, welcome back. This is Bob Burridge. This is another Bob Blast. And this one is uh, something we all know, but you know, I'm going to sound like your mother here. For me, getting ready to do a painting, the prep time in the studio is very important to me. Uh, that way I don't have to keep uh, looking for things. So I prepare everything on the table first, believe it or not, get all the colors out and so forth. And that way I don't have to mess around looking for things in the middle of a painting. And uh, I do have a few disciplines in my studio and this is one of them. Well, I lay everything out on one table and uh, here's what I do. I'd much rather do this before I paint. So I get my buckets of water. I suggest low buckets as opposed to those really high ones, right? So it's a lot easier for me to put my hands in, in the water, all right? And then we have, uh, I have the right colors out. I already have the colors out that I want to use. There's my color wheel. I have my, my paints. I have my, my acrylic fluids here, which I love very much. Here's my canvas. It's all set, ready to go. I've already primed it with an orange. I know what brushes I'm going to be using. I have my sketchbook. I've already written down my goals. I know exactly where I want to go here. Always write down the goals first. And uh, some extra tape and some rubbing alcohol. And that's pretty much the layout I do right before I do a painting. So when I'm prepared, all ready to go, I don't have to stop and start, stop and start, and things like that. Some people call this prep time uh, procrastinating. I call it percolating. You know, while you're getting yourself ready, you're thinking about the painting. It's a good way to start the day and start your painting. I'll see you on the next Bob Blast. Take care.